Before calling your Google Tech representative, let's do these steps first to avoid spending too much time on the phone with a rep. Let's first check the following. Check if you're using the most recent version of the Google Home app. If application is not up to date, then just open Play Store, search for Google Home app then run the update. Also, check if the speaker or display is plugged in and powered on. You can tell that, Google Home, Google Nest Mini, Google Home Mini, Google Home Max or Google Nest Audio is powered on, and in setup mode, when the white LED lights are blinking. It would be best, if you're in the same room, as the device. Also, make sure that Bluetooth and location, are on. If it's still unable to find it, then let's do these steps. Reboot your Google Home, by turning it off. Leave it for 5 minutes, then reconnect the power cable, back into your speaker, or display, to turn it back on.
force close and reopen the Google Home app. If it can find the device, then go with setup, if not, then let's do this next step. Go to your phone settings, check if you can see a Google Home network, if you see it, then we'll connect to that network, no need for password, then try to set it up, if not, then let's do the next step. Try using another device to set up Google Home, like another mobile phone or tablet. Also, try to move the speaker or display to a different location. This will rule out any interference in the area, which may be causing the SSID to not broadcast properly. If it still can't be detected, then we need to reset the Google Home, and try again. Here's a card, on how to reset the Google Home. If, after reset and we still getting the same result, then that's the time, we can coordinate, with our Google Home tech representative. Just let them know, what you've already done, so you can just move forward from there. The representative will inform us if we still need to do any other steps or if this needs to be consulted to a higher tier of support. Again, this is just to help us avoid staying too long on the line with a representative. By doing all the basic steps that they might ask us to do. Hopefully that was helpful and thanks for watching.